Again, I'm going to reiterate uh, what happened this morning. At approximately 10.18 a.m., the Delta State University Police Department received a call of shots fired in Joe Hall. Uh, they immediately contacted the Cleveland Police Department upon officer's arrival. Uh, the gentleman was found uh, deceased in his office, who was later identified as Ethan Schmidt. Um, we do have a person of interest at this time, and we're actively pursuing every lead that we have. Uh, at the conclusion of this press conference, we will be releasing a copy of his photograph to the press, and we ask that anyone that uh, knows this person or has contact with this person, please contact the Delta State University Police Department at area code 662-846-4155. The Cleveland Police Department at area code 662-843-3611. Our Bobber County Sheriff's Department at area code 662-843-5378. The person of interest that we're looking for is Mr. Shannon Lamb. He is a um, employee of the university. And at this time, we're following up on leads. And we have nothing else to release at this time. What, what is his connection to Professor Smith? Uh, have no, uh, have, we're not releasing any information on that so part. Just do you believe that Mr. Lamb may have been involved in a homicide in Gaucher? Uh At this time, we did have information that he possibly could be involved in a homicide, homicide in Gosha. Was that his possibly wife? Another is he still on campus? Do you think he's still on campus? At this time, we're not, we don't think he's on campus, but we're not taking anything uh, lightly. Uh, we're at the process now. We went into lockdown. Uh, we made sure that the students, faculty, staff, and administration were safe. And at this time, we're uh, methodically going building to building to uh, get the students out and let them uh, leave and go home safely. Uh, our local high school was lo lo local high schools were locked down. And at three o'clock, we will have a uh, significant police presence at these schools for the students from those schools to be able to go home to their parents' house. Were your was Margaret Green in the elementary school also locked down? What was that? Were sir? Margaret Green in the elementary school also locked down? Yes, sir. Is, there, is he connected to another homicide that happened here in town today at Miss Michigan's home? Uh, we have no information on another homicide. Do we know if he had any kind of record in the past, Mr. Uh, Lamb? You say he was an employee. In which department did he work in? I'm not sure. I was just advised that he was an employee of the university. Is he a current employee or a former employee? Uh, current employee. No students were injured. Do you have any shots were fired? Sir? Any shots were fired? No, sir. At this time, we're not releasing that information. How could weapon used? No, sir. We're not releasing that Are you going to release what he's traveling in? Uh, right now, we're not. Uh, but we will have another press conference in pro approximately an hour to an hour and a half. And uh, we will, uh, at that time, hopefully have more information for you concerning this. Right, guys, that's, that's going to conclude uh, our press conference. I'm going to let them get back to the command staff so that. Uh, you'll hang out with you. Yeah, if you'll hang out right here, we'll have a copy of the pictures of our. Uh,